Uh, do I want to continue? Excuse me, I'm adjusting my mic. Uh, hello, and welcome back. It is the new year. It, oops, it is well into the new year, and I apologize. I've not been doing videos lately. Um, we're gonna just hit okay, and we're gonna figure out where I was. This is Miracle Snack Shop. Hopefully the volume isn't too loud. It sounds really loud in my ears, so give me two seconds. Uh, how's everybody's new year going? I hope that's not too low. There we go. How's everybody new year going? Mine's going pretty okay. So we got 18 bucks. My dearest queen is awaiting. I could just do something else, I think. Uh, we're gonna hit the main story. So, there's gonna be a video I release with Amnesia Memories that I did way before. I got hung up with Peak, because I work at Amazon. So, I had a lot of overtime. So, it was, took me a while to make a video. Uh, as you know, I don't really edit these. These are all just me. And, uh... That one might have taken place at the very beginning of January. It is the 23rd right now. Meh. Whatever. Here we go. Okay. It costs zero dollars to see my queen. Per usual, I'm drinking. A week later, the queen visited again. I was just working at the store when she gracefully came down from the attic at around 1 p.m. Hello, Queen Salt. You really came. Yes, it's been a week, Ice Mason. Your troubles are appreciated. My troubles? <laughs> yes, well, troubles are never ending. Wait, what did you call me? Ice Mason? Yes, Ice Mason. Who's that? <laughs> she looks like, what do you mean? I literally just called you. Ever since Queen returned to Salt Kingdom, Queen has given you much thought. You are an artisan that, sha uh, that shaves ice, so Queen has decided to call you Ice Mason. Well, I guess it does make sense. I realized my headphones might just be louder and the volume might have been the same. Whatever, I don't want to repeat a, a monster problem where you can barely hear me over Polly's hello. <laughs> but it's a bit cringy. It's like a role playing fantasy kind of thing, which is cool. Chill out. Um, well, isn't there another title for me? You don't like Ice Mason. <laughs> No matter. Queen always prepares for alternatives. The queen has of course thought of other titles. It shall be a great honor for you, considering you are a great command over ice. Why not Ice Head? Ice Mason is better. Definitely. Yep. Is, is that so? Well then, you shall be referred to as Ice Mason. <clears throat> then, Ice Mason, make me shave ice as promised. Um, okay. I keep doing this really fucked up German, not German, oh, Russian accent. And I, I know it's wrong, but I, I still cannot remember what language she speaks. And I just know it's somewhere over there. <laughs> um, which one do you want? Hmm. This seems like a good option for today. The queen pointed at the shaved ice on the menu. Do we get to see more beautifully shaved ice? She looks unhappy with me. After she tried the shaved ice. But queen, I have another question. Are magic portals common where you live? It is not common, but you see one every now and again. Why? 
Hmm, I see. A world with portals. Then you have magic too? Yes, we have magic. Are there flying dragons? Well, there are, uh, there are in other continents, but unfortunately not in Soul Kingdom. Why is that unfortunate? The fucking dragons are terrible. Salt Kingdom is a small island. Not the right place for dragon's nest. I see. You really are from a fantasy world. Then you already knew the portals led to other worlds? Or at least other worlds? No. Queen did not realize it would lead to this place. At most, Queen thought it would lead to a different continent. But these grounds seem completely foreign. Then you went into a portal without knowing much? Yes. Um, then isn't it a bit dangerous? <laughs> Guilty. Well, let's see about that. The, the queen was extremely tired. The queen simply wanted some fresh air. So you went inside a mysterious portal to get some fresh air. Yes, a change of scenery was in order. Weren't you too reckless, though? <laughs> That's what the queen felt like. The castle felt so suffocating. The ministers were despicable. Queen wanted to just flee somewhere. So queen hesitated for a moment and entered the strange portal inside the closet. And you didn't make this portal. No, it appeared in my bedroom closet for no apparent reason. The door was shut so that no one else could discover it. No one can enter the bedroom without my permission. Hmm, I see. I understand. Clickety. <laughs> so, at the time, you just ran away from home, basically. What do you mean, ran away from home? Queen does not commit such irresponsible acts. But you said you wanted to flee somewhere. You had no idea where this lead to, or would, would lead to. Uh, anyway, Queen is not a runaway. Queen only left the castle for a moment without seeking permission to replenish my spirits. Running away from home is leaving the house without permission. This place is not cold, and there aren't any ministers to harass me. Oh, harass, harass me. That's the reason behind my occasional visit. So, so do not take it the wrong way, Ice Mason. I have a name. Yeah, yeah. You're here because you don't want to work. Got it. I don't know. I don't want to work sometimes, but I damn sure wouldn't go through a, a portal in my closet. I'm drinking out of my Sailor Moon water bottle. I love it so much. My mommy got it for Christmas. Um, two years ago. Two years? I don't know. It was 2018. Yeah, two years. Then, then since you're here, why don't you look around? Why don't you look around this world? <laughs> hmm. That's a charming suggestion. Queen is inclined. Then prepare quite a- uh, oof. Sorry, y'all. Then prepare a carriage so Queen can observe the local sights. We don't have carriages here. Uh. We have something similar called automobiles. Y yes, that's what Queen meant. There must be a similar method of transportation. But you weren't so confident in demanding a carriage. Or, but you were so confident in demanding a carriage. Then hurry up and prepare the auto carriage thing. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Okay, keep thinking that's her belly, but it's her arm covering her stomach. Oh, look at you. You look so happy. Look at your hair. It's just like whoosh. <laughs> oh, this carriage has a peculiar look. My car was parked in front of the store, and Queen Salt and I got in. Aren't I in debt? How could I afford a car? Well, people in debt afford cars. What am I talking about? I'm an idiot. Any but. 
I wasn't particularly self-conscious, but it felt strange being a car, like being in the car alone with her. She's just so adorable. I can't help it. Uh, <laughs> sorry. We definitely weren't going on a drive as a date. I was just helping the queen look around the world, uh, this world. But I felt strange for some reason. Queen, you have to put on your seatbelt first. A seatbelt? Seatbelt. It's a belt that ties you to the chair. It's just in case a car suddenly comes to a halt. Oh, don't give me that look. You make me feel like a pervert. Uh, what? What? Tie me up? No, it's not what you think. No, it's not what you're thinking. <laughs> choo choo, angry. Uh, Queen is disappointed in thou. Ooh, did you want me to tie you up? What? Do you think me as a fool? How dare you trick me? How dare you trick me as such? Do you think Queen will bear the shame of letting you tie me up with your hands? <sighs> Queen is thoroughly disappointed, Ice Mason. What treachery were you planning? After binding me up, I just, I just forcefully pulled the seatbelt and put it on her. I don't see no seatbelt. How dare you, you impotent man! How dare you touch the queen without permission? Ugh. Oh, there it is. That's inappropriate. Mm. Uh huh. Queen Salt start pulling the seatbelt left and right. Pfft, idiot. You just start smiling immediately. You knew exactly that I meant no harm. Oh, Ice Mason. This is, uh, this is fascinating object. It lengthens no matter how much Queen pulls. Oh, that was a question. Whoops. I told you it's not what you were thinking. <laughs> Well, Queen misunderstood what you meant by tying me up. You speak in third and first person, which bothers me. Hmm. So this is what a seatbelt is. So, it's a strap that prevents me from falling when the carriage suddenly stops. Yep, that's it. Once the hassle of putting the seatbelt over her was over, I turned to the engine. He almost feels like he's dealing with a child. Like, shut up. Put it on. Let's go. That's not a pleasant sound, I know. My bad. I slowly drove through downtown. Ooh. Ooh. She started. She stared out the window with sparkling eyes. I see this every day, so I couldn't see anything special in it. But I suppose it seems spectacular to the queen, or to this queen from a fantasy world. Ice Mason, Ice Mason. These grounds are filled with such peace. Everyone has smiles across their faces. All the smiling ones are probably couples. The words came up to my throat, but I didn't bother to let it out. The air is fresh, and the streets are so f uh, fragrant. People here smell nice. You also give off a great scent. <laughs> Do I? I do use cologne. Using perfume means you are born of a higher class. The lower ones don't wash themselves at all, and that's why they s the streets stink. Oof, you oof. The, the ghettos must smell terrible. When we first met, uh, when we first met, Queen noticed the scent you gave off and thought you belonged to a higher class. Um. Thank you for thinking so highly of me. Ice Mason. Tell me, uh, tell me of the... Ugh, fuck. Sorry. <laughs> Ice Mason, tell me of the one who rules over these grounds. The owner of these grounds? Um... Well, the one who rules over these grounds... The district chief? A ruler who keeps this ground so clean must be an excellent ruler. Where's the ruler's castle? Um, it's only a few minutes away by car. Hmm, we 
you would like to see the castle. Fetch me there. All right, it's not that far. This is a bad idea. You have no idea how bad of an idea this is. I didn't mean to be on Google. I drove to the district office and the queen started, or started, not her. The queen stared at the building through the window. I would like her to be looking out the window and not at me. Hmm. That's the castle where the ruler lives? Yep. But the castle's walls are nowhere to be found. And it's much more humble than Queen expected. Huh. Are you sure we are at the right place? The building on the street... Oh, fuck. The building on the street seemed more extravagant. The ruler's castle must be more grand and splendid. That just seems like a bigger god post. Anyway, the person equivalent to our ruler lives here. Hmm, but no one is coming to greet me. He may be a spectacular ruler, but he has no manners. Oh, well, that's because we didn't tell them that we were coming. Uh is that so? Queen naturally assumes that you contact them beforehand. I didn't. Why not? Uh, how should I explain this? Oof. Tell a convincing lie or tell the truth. Whoa, it's my first choice in the game. Ah. Uh. Ah. Uh. Mmm. Ooh. I'm all about telling the truth, to be honest. A uh, convincing lie to tell my queen. I don't know if I told her the truth, she could be like, Nonsense! This motherfucker should be able to see me. I am a queen, and we can have a conversation. A convincing lie? I don't know if I'm actually convincing. I could be like, Well, this castle, I am a lowly peasant, and I cannot contact a castle. She'd be like, Oh, well, I will tell him how great you are. You are a great ice mason, and I will tell about your glories. And I'm like, Oof. Mmm. Ah. <laughs> Don't. Uh, tell them the truth. Yes? The ruler probably won't believe that you're a real queen. Oh, that's not what I meant! <laughs> is... is that so? you recognize me as the queen right away? Well, that's because you came through my fucking attic through a portal. I just believed what you said. Uh, uh, so, so you're saying you didn't really know that I'm the queen, but just believe me because queen said I'm the queen? Y yes. <laughs> I knew she was going to get mad at me. Queen is not quite sure if you're clever or a fool. Still, I can tell, tell you for sure that this ruler won't believe you so easily. Hmm. Yes, there's no need to rush. Yeah, there goes the sweet face. Then let's return. Oh, you're going back already? Yes, my ministers will worry if Queen, didn't, uh, Queen does not show my face for too long. Alright. Again, the skin type where it just dips into your belly button bothers me, but other than that, your outfit is really cute. Queen will return for the day. Okay, come again. Yes, may the Queen's grace be with you. She gave me the same goodbye as last time and returned to her wor world. Woo! There's no activity for today. I don't even have a story mode thing? Can I study? Ocean shaped ice practice. Woo! Reviews? 
I want shaved ice that's true to its basics. Profile? I don't know who you are. Mm, we're not doing great. <laughs> I'm study. Oh, I don't have enough. Fuck. What do I do? Oh my god, I can't even study? Uh, what? Okay. <laughs> that does nothing for me. I can't study. Oh no, what do I do? Open? Do you want to open the storm tarpons? Yes, I need money. Okay. I missed this. Wait, those were bad reviews. <laughs> okay. Wait, what happened? Okay. Actions. $50. Fuck! Oh, they're all main story stuff. Uh, a visit to the supermarket with Queen Salt, which is 50 bucks. Uh, Queen Salt and Sweet Red Bean Porridge. Only $10. I could totally just pay for that. I could pay for this one now, though. Because if I pay for this one, I'll have less and I won't be able to do that. A walk with this beautiful woman is free, though. I got a new review. Oh, I got bad reviews. Uh, is this your best human? Have you ever tried Saved Ice VI? It's super fun. Um, do you know a place that sells cheap phones? A motherfucker, this is a shaped ice. I miss this. It tastes like boot camp cafeteria food. Um, unfortunately, the shaped ice place is out. You don't give any point discounts? <laughs> gonna paste the- <laughs> gonna post this on Facebook. Um, fudge nugget nougat. Yorin slash fish shaped bun shaped ice is required. Fish shaped buns. Do you have any fish shaped buns here? I don't. I can do this? Her desire food is not ready. Fuck. Actions. Study. $40? Really? Oh my goodness. Um, well, you know what? We're gonna do this next time. So, we're gonna save up. Figure this out. Day 15? Whoa, what did I do between these? Do I have- Oh, things have to be figured out. Alright, I'll, I'll catch you guys later. G goodbye.